Hey, welcome to my Cry Moon Child. This is an unboxing video for the Telluric Tarot. It came in this box this morning. Um, so this is just a quick flick through to have a look at the deck. I'm just going to take it out. The has this little velvety bag in with it. Plast it's got like a plasticky texture to it, but you can never say no to a, a tarot deck bag. Let's have a look. So as I said, this is the Telluric Tarot. So there's the thank you card from Lum Lunaria Gold. And their details. Look at that image. Oh my God, I love it. I love it. So this is the Telluric Tarot. It has a bigger box than most of the standard boxes that are coming from Kickstarter. This was a Kickstarter deck. I have a lot of these coming in. I think my next deck that I back is going to be my 50th, which is probably going to be the Young Witch Tarot. If you have a kid or you're a beginner, get along and have a look at the Young Witch Tarot because there's some cool stuff on there. So I'm just taking the plastic off the box. There we go. So this is the Telluric Tarot. I'll show you the box now. So it has a gloss printed box. This is the side, top, the other side, the bottom, and then the back has all the details there as well. Although I will link all the social media down below. Let's have a look, let's lift this off. I'm so excited for this one because it's botanical and crystals, and I'm trying to learn both. There we go, let's have a look. Oh my god. So we have this booklet. Look at the booklet. That's a proper booklet, a proper hefty booklet. Wow. Oh my God. Oh my God, it smells amazing. Um, so yeah, the Telluric Tarot, an oracle of stones and plants by Lunaria Gold. And then obviously it has soul cards. Um, emotions, which are cups, drive, wands, mind, swords, domain, pentacles. Um, and then it goes through each of the cards. So it has bismuth and fern. It has the picture, colour image, which you don't always get in books. Um, obviously, it's number, and the name, a uh, bit of a keyword, a description. And it's got reversed meanings. You don't always get reversed meanings. Going through each of the cards. I will go through them individually in a moment through the deck. Um, so, yeah, tourmaline and orchid. And then it's got muscovite and milkweed. Peridot and Wisteria, and then it goes through each of them, 11, 12, 13, 14, so it goes from 0 to 14 for each of these suits, so to speak, so 0, 1, 2, yep, 2, 3, for each of the suits, I'll go through them in a moment. It's not like a traditional tarot deck as such, but that's not always a bad thing. All the way through to Jedi and Beat. It's lovely. And then obviously the artwork on the back. The artwork in this deck is what I am most excited about. It's what drew me in in the beginning. Oh my God, it's got foiling. Hang on, let me just take it out of this plastic wrapping. All these decks that have plastic wrappings. They all do it. They all do it. And it's because they're packed packaged up like it and it i get it it's just it just makes me a little bit sad every time i see them <laughs> with it but it's unavoidable if the if the people that are printing it are doing it it's unavoidable so they're quite glossy they have this gorgeous design on the back almost like a crystal heart with flowers around absolutely stunning so i'm going to go through this so infinity because that's what i know is that symbol also um by the way um just yeah foiling Boiling for days. Beautiful. Gold. Shiny gold. Jing, jing, jing. It's lovely. So, bismuth and fern. Labradorite and rubus. Arctic, Arcticus. Uh, polybastite and dogwood. Benitoite, benitoite and mojave sage. Lapizuli and crocus sativus. Copper and eucalyptus. Storolite and oak. Hematite quartz and pomegranate, lodestone and jawweed, opal and diphilia, 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 uh, enstatite and polylepis, amylite and amaranth, topaz and aloe vera, amber and brezza, aragonite and ghost pipe, paparadska and water lily, rialga and hellebore. 
Libyan Desert Glass and Fire Lily, Aquamarine and Borage, uh, Ilmenite and Cereus, Chrysoberyl and Olive, Pearl and Yew, Tourmaline and Orchid, that's Watermelon Tourmaline by the look of it, Muscovite and Milkweed, Peridot and Wisteria, Amazonite and Myosotis, Petzotatite and Toulouse, Hanksite and Water Hyacinth, and Hydrite and Anemone, Stibnite and Cart, Cart, Adderstone and Clover, Iceland Spa and Wormwood, Emerald and Rose, Iris Agate and Flax, Dioptase and Lily of the Valley, Rhodochrosite and Fur, Diaspore, Spit Diaspore and Magnolia, Gypsum and Laurel, Chalcoprite and Grape, Diamond and Barley, Alexandrite and Apple, I love that, and Annulite and Ivy, I need some Annulite in my life, that's gorgeous, Gold and Venus Flytrap, Howlite and Desert Mil Mil Mistletoe, Citrine and Vetch, Silver and Cassava, Garnet and Cherry, Turquoise and Lavender, Chaldency and Sandalwood, Mal Malachite and Sweet Pea, Zircon and Dandelion, Tanzanite and Fig, Jadeite and Beet, Phosophilite and Phosphorite and Juniper, Basite and Daphne, Hemimorphite and Bindweed, Actinolite and Oleander, Moonstone and Poppy, Cinnabar and Blackthorn, Amethyst and Willow, Hackmanite and Belladonna, Tiger's Eye and Teasel, Echinite and Cypress, Euclase and Asphodel, Celestite and Pansy, Fluorite and Coffea, Lepidite, Lepidolite and Gentian, Ice and Edelweiss, Edelweiss, Sulphur and Rowan, Wolfenite and Torch Lily, Appetite and Strong Gilodon, Andalusite and Cottonwood, Spindle, Spinel and Bamboo, Obsidian and Nettle, Cerasite and Alstromeria, Crocotite, Crocoite and Furs, Pyrite and Alanthus, Sinhalite and Bloodroot, Chalcinthite and Kudzu, Aventurine and Buttercup, Spodumene and Talansia, Rainbow Lattice and Strezzalizia, Cuprite and Nasternium. Let's just have a look at how they shuffle. They're quite heavy. So the cardstock is quite thin, bouncy, plenty of give, but not bend like not going to give and bend in your hands. Let's have a look. They shuffle. Lovely. It's lovely. They're slightly glossy, not too glossy. As you can see, they're glossy, but they're not picking up fingerprints. It's not sticky. Oh, some sort of bug stuck on the back of that one. I'll, I'll move that and we'll clean that off in a minute. Yeah, nice. Um, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah. There you go. I'll clear that one off in a minute. I'll have a flick through, make sure he's... Not on the other side as well, but hmm. Hmm. there you go. I had a little extra bit of protein in there. I'll clean that off and put that back in a minute. But yeah, that is the Telluric Tarot by Lunaria Gold. Absolutely stunning. If I will put all the details up below. If you can get a copy, absolutely get a copy. Um, it's got a really light, earthy, obviously because of the crystals. But like an educational, um, not like I'm going to teach you, but like I'm happy to teach you if you want to learn kind of energy about it. It's beautiful. The artwork is just, oh, watercolour, but oh, stunning. Um, I hope that's showing you everything you want to know about Telluric Tarot. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you again soon. Bye for now.